and now we're going to go ahead and basically import our seed here and just simply place it um, and you know we're probably going to have to make some edits to it um, so that it's going to fit the car we're definitely going to need two seats in there and not just one but like I said I mean we're definitely going to have to have to edit the shape here probably a little bit so that we can get that inside of the car and placed properly and a lot of this of doing the inside of the car is just going to take a little bit of extra time because you have to figure out you know well how's it going to look and how are we going to be placing this and we sort of have to basically put the car together and so I'm you know constantly going to be you know uh, is it going to work here if I place it here? Is it going to work here if I place it there? Type thing, and it, it's just all in you know how you want to model the inside of the car, and it's just trial and error basically. So what you see placed here is probably not going to be the the final end result. This is more or less just a template of you know where the seats are going to be and trying to place them properly and then you know basically model the inside of the car and um, or a good portion of the inside of the car so that we can you know have those seats placed generally in the right area um, so that's going to look correct And now I'm just trying to, you know, make sure and trying to, you know, get the the back seat here of how I'm gonna how I'm gonna get it placed. Um, I'll definitely have to go ahead and delete probably the, um, the mechanics off of the wheels simply because whenever we go to do the inside portions of the wheel well, those aren't gonna necessarily fit properly. So I'm definitely gonna have to delete. I know I'm definitely gonna have to delete the mechanic part of the wheel off so that we can get um, you know the car looking right but once we add wheel wells it you know won't necessarily matter and that's just because our seats gonna you know pretty much be sitting here in the back and it's just not gonna have enough room inside of the car and right now I'm just you know thinking to myself you know how am I going to get this seat to be placed properly and how is, how is it supposed to be scaled inside of the car um, you know that's looking okay right now but like I said I'm definitely going to have to edit it whenever I start modeling the inside portion of the car um, and it just takes a little bit of trial and error you know, usually to get it done right doing the in inside ports of, of cars I mean it just takes time it's all and it's just you know trial and error trial and error 